now days away from Election Day for Atlanta's next mayor. And this afternoon, we have an exclusive new poll. New at 6. Take a look. Keisha Lance Bottoms is now the front runner separated from Mary Norwood by just two points. Channel 2's Dave Huddleston live at City Hall covering this. Dave, our pollster told you this is a really a two person race now. And according to our numbers, Norwood and Bottoms are the only two candidates with 20% of the vote. The other candidates fall far behind, but this race isn't over, and anything could happen. There's a new leader in the race. That leader is Keisha Lance Bottoms. In our exclusive WSB TV AJC Landmark Communications poll, we asked 750 likely voters if the election for mayor of Atlanta were held today, for whom would you vote? Bottoms is up six points and leads with 25.4 percent. She's the only African American female in the race, and so far her opponents have not really landed a glove on her politically. Mary Norwood, once the trailblazer, falls to second place with 23.4 percent. Our pollster says Norwood's campaign has flatlined. Whatever message she's been advocating has not moved her into the 30s. She, it has not helped her propel into a, a permanent first place. We sat down with Mark Roundtree and crunched the numbers. On this last day of early voting, he says there is still a chance another candidate could slide into a runoff position, but it's going to be tough. If get out the vote matters, that could have an impact. How does the other candidates do? Roundtree says Peter Amon hasn't pushed past 12 percent. Kathy Willard and Vincent Ford actually increased their results, but trail by more than double digits. And after picking up key endorsements and lots of money in the bank, Caesar Mitchell's message hasn't connected with voters. Caesar Mitchell has spent a lot of money, and it, it just hasn't had an impact on the electorate. It's really that simple. So the bottom line, Roundtree says with four days out, this is a two-woman race. I think it'll be a runoff between Mary Norwood and Keisha Lance Bottoms. And the margin of error in our poll, 3.6%. Roundtree says the real poll is Tuesday, election day, and everything could shift if there's a huge get out the vote this weekend or if there's major news about one of the candidates. Reporting live from City Hall, Dave Huddleston, Channel 2 Action News.